Entra is a company based in Milan, Italy, and we are uh, an ISP. We decided to develop CloudUp to uh, deliver a service uh, on a paper use, self-service and uh, build per minute uh, service to our customers. There are mostly four reasons uh, for which we have uh, adopted OpenStack. The first one is uh, technical. Uh, OpenStack is flexible enough to allow us to build our product as we imagined it. The second one is economical. Uh, since we do not pay any license, we are not charging the customers for any license, so we, our product is less expensive than others. And uh, the third one is philosophical. It's open source and we like it. And the first reason uh, is a marketing reason. We want to be considered innovators in the European uh, service provider market. We launched the product in uh, May 2012. We started with four nodes. Uh, in less than a year, we have reached uh, 20 nodes. And now we have uh, more than 4,000 subscriptions. The public cloud is part of HP's overall converged cloud offerings. We're very proud to leverage OpenStack along with HP Technology Innovation to provide an enterprise-grade public cloud uh, with the highest levels of SLAs in the industry. So we use OpenStack to provide compute services. We use it for object store, uh, image uh, services such as Glance, and combine that with work above the infrastructure that we do, such as databases of service and load balances service, to be able to provide developers the full suite of capabilities they need to be able to build and deploy a very wide range of workloads. We are the first company to be part of the foundation. Um, we are the first service provider to use OpenStack to provide public cloud services to the Latin American market. We are working in Mexico, Central America, South America. Uh, we provide all our support in Spanish. We provide all our sales and, and, and content in Spanish to, to this market. We are using OpenStack to provide public services to the SMB market. Uh, make, uh, Latin America is a market of $300 million for cloud services and we have probably the highest growth rate in the world in cloud services. Well, the SMB market is, is, is not so big like the mid-size or enterprise, but they have, they have the same demand for functionalities like the big companies. Then we are sure that with OpenStack we can attain this kind of needs. We like the way that OpenStack is integrate other components of the solution using standard protocols and this helped us to, to, to integrate the solution with our market play for, for SMB market. Our customers are primarily entrepreneurs and developers. So they're individuals, developers, small businesses that are getting on the web um, setting up websites, setting up blogs, and then also starting to develop applications and so on. So we see it really as our mission to enable the, the global community of entrepreneurs and developers to take advantage of cloud computing, take advantage of web hosting, and uh, through doing so, just empower this new generation of developers and, and creativity. So DreamHost uh, took a big step about a year and a half ago to commit to OpenStack. Um, we wanted to launch a public cloud computing service that was um, a, a new extension to our web hosting and virtual private server business and we were getting a lot of demand from our customers for it so we engineered and launched a new service that's now in preview called Dream Compute. Dream Compute is a uh, publicly available cloud computing service um, similar to other public clouds out there. It uses OpenStack as the foundation for most of the code um, we use um, almost all of the major projects within OpenStack to build the service and then we've also extended it in certain ways with some networking extensions and then also with some storage extensions. So in the end we've been able to combine OpenStack and all the features of uh, compute. Um, we've been able to incorporate um, storage um, with Ceph and with uh, virtual networking as well. 
um, using Nasira and some extensions. So we're able to provide a service that's incredibly uh, uh, useful to developers and uh, they're able to do the cool things with it that they really, really want. So um, if they want to run web workloads like WordPress or Drupal or Joomla, they can very easily set up either a single WordPress instance or they can set up multiple instances. So we're all about basically taking, uh, you know, setting a new standard in compute as a service and taking it to the masses. Innovance is a multi-cloud expert. We uh, operate two clouds, one in Paris and one in Montreal. So the, the cloud we operate is named uh, InnoCloud. Um, InnoCloud is based on OpenStack, and the reason why we based uh, InnoCloud on OpenStack, well, there are multiple reasons. The first reason is we wanted to have the ability to innovate as much as we wanted. Uh, we wanted to be able to uh, have uh, value uh, in the cloud, which is different from our competition. We also wanted to have full control of our hardware, uh, not uh, let someone else take the control on our hardware, on our VR. And finally, OpenStack is open source, so that means that we can decide what margin we make on our product without having to pay for a huge amount of licensing to a third party. So one thing that is very important for us is uh, to be able to uh, offer services across multiple clouds. We, we not only offer uh, public cloud services, but manage services across multiple clouds, across Rackspace Cloud, across uh, Amazon Cloud, and our cloud. So we are, one thing that was very important for us was to have uh, a cloud that would be as compatible as possible with other clouds. Uh, Rackspace is one of the largest clouds in the world. Uh, we run uh, you know, across multiple data centers on multiple continents. Uh, OpenStack really allows us to do that. It, it is a very scalable platform. It gives us the tools and the scale uh, behind the scenes that we need to serve customers in all those locations. And the technology is advancing so fast that it's actually keeping up with our pace of growth and innovation. We want to go fast. We want to do lots of things around the, the world. And I think OpenStack is really powering uh, the, the growth engine that is our, that our public cloud. Uh, OpenStack is one of those technologies core to our success. It's been the thing that we've based every one of our services on. Uh, we wanted to use it in the public cloud, but we also wanted to use it in the private cloud. We think one of the keys to adoption of cloud computing is the fact that customers are not locked in. They have choice of where they deploy. They want to be able to deploy sometimes in the public cloud, uh, sometimes in the private cloud, and sometimes in a data center that is in a geography where there is no public cloud. And that's really what OpenStack enables us to do is give that customer the choice of where they deploy and in, in, in what context. I, I think when, when we think about our, the benefits to our end customers, or the end client uh, of Rackspace, it's the fact that they are able to use uh, high quality, low cost infrastructure to power their applications. These are real businesses running on our cloud. These are not, uh, you know, we, a lot of times in the public cloud you assume that these are test workloads. These are production workloads. People are running real things on the cloud and they needed to be reliable, they needed to be secure, they needed to be stable, uh, consistent, and, and really relatively low cost. We're very excited about the ecosystem, the growth of the, the OpenStack community has been tremendous. It's, it's growing in terms of commitment from all the vendors, and that just solidifies OpenStack's role in our future. There's no doubt in our mind, we're all in with OpenStack, have been since the early days, and see no end in sight with this. OpenStack has allowed HP to really enter the public cloud business in a very rapid way, leveraging both our own work and the great contributions of the broader community. And certainly for our customers, they look for open and transparent solutions. The ability for people to have interoperability among different clouds from different providers based upon the OpenStack APIs is an exceptionally important thing for our customers. In addition, our customers are looking for transparency. 
they can actually look at the OpenStack code and understand how the cloud works so they can optimize their workloads. Something that's not possible within many other cloud providers. So the, the business value for Innovance and for our client is about the same. The ability to deploy a cloud without having uh, to share the cost of uh, a, pri a proprietary solution. Um, the ability to innovate on the cloud by providing additional features um, before anyone else and contributing that to the community. Having the ability to share the burden with so many uh, companies around the world on maintaining this software infrastructure that we are building together. Uh, we think that all the vendor participation within OpenStack, if you think about who's involved, it's the network vendors, the storage vendors, the compute vendors, people that are building a very innovative uh, hardware and, and solution stacks around OpenStack. That's the power of the ecosystem behind it. Uh, it helps us uh, think ahead two steps, be, you know, really from where we are today and where we're going to need to be in the future. And I think that's, that's a, a great win for us to have that, you know, that big community behind us.